what do you think changed now to become successful on YouTube? Like, what do you think is most important for a creator coming up? Maybe you'll agree with me, but I feel like being authentic is becoming less popular because now you have to like, to really bang on YouTube now, you have to follow the algorithm. So what's that do that makes you focus on what the algorithm wants to see versus what maybe you want to do, right? Yeah. So look at the biggest YouTubers right now. And look, you can be yourself and pop. You can pull millions of views, but if you want to be that guy that's pulling the millions, the, the 20s, the 30s, the 50s, you are playing a very hard game with the algorithm. And you understand it. You probably have a lot of people understanding it around you. Yeah. Back when we were doing it, it was just like, Dude, you, you could, I don't know. You could do anything and stand out. You're like, look what he's doing. Now I can do the same stuff. And it's like, dude, this has been done a thousand times. Yeah. You, know, you, think just, you think just because of the saturation that it's just so much more difficult? Yeah, it's saturated. And every day there's, you know, another thousand kids just wanting to be YouTubers. hundred thousand kids wanting to be YouTubers. Yeah. It's only getting more flooded. So how do you stand out? Right. But and do you like, think, do you think you stand out by following the, the thing that everyone follows? It's not following the thing that everyone follows. It's understanding what the computer is going to favor. Of course. Yeah. Right? So you can make your same video, but if you understand the algorithm, it's going to pop a lot harder. Of course. But when we were doing it, there was no like system. Yeah. It was if you got the most views, you were trending that day. Yeah. It just, and it, that trend made you pop. Yeah. It now, sucks yeah. now because it makes yeah. everything feel a little bit more contrived where it's just like we're now just people are, like you said are doing things just to please the algorithm and then the algorithm and the platform itself we were talking about on your podcast is like it's skewed it's yeah. skewed it has to be a certain way if you say certain things you're going to get popped here you, you talk about this it's not going to be go over well there like it, and we know as creators now who've been doing this for so long oh if i talk about this or if i say this or if mm -hmm. i say this then my my videos are going to get affected by it and it's just kind of like a if to me it's becoming a weird place and like we were saying on your podcast as well that i'm really grateful for like this kind of content yeah that it doesn't seem to be as um i don't know it seems it's not as like hammered yeah as unless i had like a 10 12 minute video saying something stupid yeah. maybe maybe that'll change who knows someone's gonna hear this podcast and then yeah. fucking run the algorithm through it a little bit deeper but <sighs> it just feels different now man where it's like a lot of creators know i can't say this so like, I'm not then just being my true authentic self. Cause like, there's yeah. a lot of things I'd love to say sure. that like, I just don't, because I know that like, you are going to be f like, not, not because of the public reaction. Yeah. It's more so because I think a lot of the public reaction, there's things I would say that people be like, yo, that's true. And I wish more people said it. Yeah. It's because the platform itself is going to, is going to like basically bury your shit. Yeah. I think the number one goal and this is like so cliche, but it's like, you got to find your path. You yeah. got to find your path like, and, and you'll find joy on the path, right? Like if you're in it just for money, like hold on tight, you're going to have a long ride. Oh yeah. You're going to have a long ride. You're going to go through a you're lot of miserable too. I lost money for years for easily three years. I lost money on YouTube. Like before I made a dollar, I lost money. It was sacrifice. It was commitment. It was time. It was, but I freaking loved it. Yeah. And that makes it all worth it. So I don't know if you're trying to create content, just be you, man. Like people will attach to authentic people. Like you can, you can, bro, you can, you can read people, you yeah. know, when somebody's not being authentic. Yeah, for sure. And when they're authentic, people gravitate to that. Yeah. You, there's enough eyeballs to find you. Like yeah, it for takes sure. time. Like be patient and make sure you're having fun doing it. And it won't be, it won't be so bad.